up guys, it's Bailey, back with another daily video. <laughs> hey guys, what's up, it's Bailey, back with another daily video. And as you can tell, I am blonde. I just came back from the beach and you know, I have been waiting so long to film this video. And as you can tell by the title, it's going to be a good one. And I thought I was gonna get all cute. And all dressed up. And all magnificent. And I was like, you know what? I'm just gonna put on the sweater, the sweatpants, and I'm just gonna go for it. I just kinda wanna hop into it and show you guys the biggest pretty little thing haul for, I guess, fall, autumn, winter, loungewear, pullover, sweater, hoodie, whatever you call this thing, and I'm gonna get into it. So I'm gonna start with Brandy Melville, and then I'm gonna move along to Pretty Little Thing because I only got two things from Brandy, and real quick, real quick. Let's just, let's just talk about Brandy really quick. Their sizes are no sizes. <laughs> they have no sizes, they are not inclusive, so um, I didn't know that until I ordered from them and I was like, okay, because I'm a small, small medium, so all their clothes fit me, but I just thought they were running out of what I wanted. So I just was thinking like, well, I want a size large in this, so it can be oversized, but I guess I'll just get a size small. And that is not the case. With further research and watching like more YouTube videos, I found out that this clothing brand only specializes clothes for small sizes. So that is very controversial, and I didn't know that that was a thing until after I ordered it, and I was even talking to my brother's girlfriend. Ha ha, shout out Olivia. She was talking to me about it, and I had no idea. So I'm just gonna show you these two items. If you're a small medium like me, I feel like you'll really like them, and if you're not a girl, don't you worry, I have Pretty Little Thing coming right up next. So the first thing that I wanna show you guys is this super cute, adorable yellow sweater i call these sweaters so um this is from brandy melville it's the honey sweatshirt and it's heavy it's a really good material i really like it it's comfy it fits me kind of weird because again i wanted a large so it could be super oversized and i would wear it with cute black knee high boots and it would be adorable but you know it is what it is um it's soft the embroidery on the honey is like very very nice and i think this was about okay so this erica honey sweatshirt was 35 bucks and i mean that's not bad but like at the same time it's just like and eh, it's 35 dollars and it's a sweater so like i don't know how i felt about that Really cute on, especially with my brown hair and my blonde bun, I really like it. It will keep you warm. This is a hot sweater. I cannot wear this all the time. I live in Florida, so you guys know that this is definitely like one of those options. Like, I have to wear this when it gets a little cold out, you know what I'm saying? So that's the first item. Really love it, super cute. The next item from Brandy is this sweatshirt that I actually wore today to the beach, and if you follow me on Instagram, you know, the pictures I posted, I took them in this, so. Um, I'll insert those here. And I just think it's super cute. It's not a sweater like I thought, because again, this is in a size small. And I thought the sweater would be something like, I don't know, I just thought it would be more oversized, because on the model, it's oversized, but on, you know, a schmedium girl, it's kind of like a crop top. <laughs> so um, I just really like it. It's very thin, it's knitted, and it, is very heavily scented, okay? Can we just talk about this? When I got this in the mail, this smelled like so much perfume. It smelled like... Heavy. Like if somebody was like, okay, she wants this one. Here you go. Like it just was like, I came in the mail and I was like, oh my God. It was heavily scented, but it's cute. This will not keep you warm. This is definitely a fashion statement. I wanna wear it with like a skirt or pair it with something like that. You definitely have to wear a shirt or a bra underneath this like you can't just go like free the nips with this shirt because it is see-through it's see-through honey like it's see-through with all this knitting i think but yeah it's super cute it says los angeles and it's yellow and navy so i thought that was adorable but yeah it's a crop top on a medium girl but if you're an extra small or like you know you fit kids clothing <laughs> And this will fit you great. So the Jessica Los Angeles sweater from Brandy Melville was $38. And I just feel like, mm. but that is it for Brandy Melville. The next thing we're gonna move on to is Pretty Little Thing. Sorry, my phone's on the charger. I'm just, my, my camera keeps dying. So the next item that I have for you guys, I'm gonna go over the small things before I get into the sweaters. So I got these two crop tops. The first crop top that I got is in white and it's one of those really cute over the shoulder 
crop tops and she's see-through, okay? It's thin, but I think that's good if you're like tailgating or you're outside somewhere at a party or 4th of July. She's thin. Look, she breezes, okay? Like, you need to wear something under her or... She... Yeah, everybody's just gonna see all your goodies. This was just a little too thin for me. I like it on me. It's cute. I wear cute things underneath it. Like, it's like a whole piece of an outfit. Sometimes I just wear it with shorts. Like, I'm probably pairing it right now with shorts, but yeah, it's super thin really cute it's not forgiving so that's really nice love that and then the next crop top that i have is a different style crop top it's still over the shoulder but it has these most ridges in it like these little lines and it has this thin strapped shoulder these kind of go at an awkward angle i don't know if you can see it in my try on but like it kind of swoops down a little too low. This falls on me and I got this in a medium. I think both of these shirts are in a medium. Anyways, so yeah, this is a really nice crop top. Um, it kind of swoops down just a little bit, but you know, other than that, it's super cute. And so both of these I got in a size medium. It says it was a four around, but those actually, I think were only $11 for both of them. Let me check my screenshots. Yeah, so both of those were five bucks. So it was $10 for both of those. I think for $5, they're amazing. I think I got exactly what I asked for. So the next thing I'm going to talk about is the black and gray basic bike short two pack size four. I just got everything in a size four because I thought like if it's too big, I can cut it and make it smaller. But if it's like too small, then like what am I going to do? You know, I don't have more fabric. The next thing I got is these biker shorts and I got black and gray and they're see-through. So if you're planning to wear this with like a crop top, you cannot do that. They are see-through. They are so see-through, you can see my face through them. So don't buy these. You wanna wear a crop top, but if you wanna wear any of these sweaters with them, these mediums cover my butt. So like you'll be able to wear long sweaters over them to cover your booty area. But these are a lot more see-through and softer than the gray ones. So the gray ones are a little more coarse. I'm not gonna lie, when you put them on, they're a little itchy on your legs. So I did not like that because when I put them on, I'm uncomfortable and I bought them to be comfy. So I did not like that. But um, they're kind of scratchy feeling. And I noticed that this they have this weird um, thing in the back where it pulls on this side and it's straight on this side. And I don't know what that does for anyone or if I just messed them up. But like, I don't know, I just didn't care for that. I thought they were weirdly made, but I think for both of these, they were only $11. It was seven bucks for both of these. So, I mean, $7 for two pairs of shorts. I, you know, I got what I paid for it. And I think the black ones are nice. I wear them with the sweaters, so. Yeah. If you're gonna go get these, you, they come in a bunch of different colors on the website. So, I mean, they're only seven bucks. I think that's great. The next thing I'm mad about because this, took five ever to come in the mail. Everything took about two weeks to get in and I ordered a lot of stuff, but this took three freaking weeks. So these are the Pretty Little Thing Gray Basic Cuffed Hem Jogger, size four, color gray, and they were $11. So I just got a size four because I like baggy, especially my sweatpants, I want them to fit me nice and comfy, but these kind of fit me just nicely. I thought I was a two. I thought I was like fit a perfect two because in jeans over here in the US, I fit a two perfectly. So I thought like, you know, four, they'll be baggy. It'll be really cute, really nice. But the fours just kind of fit me like regular sweatpants, how I was expecting the twos to fit me. So if you want baggy, baggy sweatpants, I would suggest going up two sizes. But if you want something that fits you um, kind of right, then go up one size. If you want pants that fit you like, like tight, you know, then pick the pick the, your size. But these ones are in a four and they stretch really, really, really wide. So I like that. But when they're sitting on the hips, they don't look as baggy. Um, they're really thin and they're really scratchy. So there's a difference between the way that these feel on the inside. These feel like a blanket that you just have to touch in Walmart. You know what I mean? Am I the only one? This is really soft on the inside. And these are not. This is almost like a jersey material on this, the inside. It looks like snake scales, um, but I did not like that because it just feels itchy and it's not comfy when I put it on. So did not like that. And I didn't like how long these took. The, just these in particular, singly, took forever to come in. And I don't know why, but I know that their gray sweatpants are in high demand. But these are really cute gray sweatpants. So I really like these and they are very nice. And you know, for $11, that's not bad. So the next thing that I got is exactly this right here. 
It is the ultimate oversized sweater in the color gray, size medium, and this was $28. So I think it's really cute. It is so baby soft on the inside, and it's a cute, cozy sweater. If I stand up, you can see how it's kind of oversized because I got a medium and not a small, so that's important. I was worried that the medium was gonna fit me a little too tight, but I'm a small, so this is kind of big, so I kind of like that. And it's just comfy, it's like everyday airport loungewear when I'm editing, when I wake up in the morning or I have to take my dog out for a walk in the morning, I'll just throw one of these sweaters on. And to be honest with you, I think they're very high quality and it's super cute. You can dress these up, dress them down, so I really like this gray one. It's a bit bigger than these baby blue ones that I'm gonna show you or these you know, tan ones that I'm gonna show you, the sand colored ones. But other than that, this is the best sweater that I own. It's super cute. And if you guys like loungewear like I do, like I love loungewear, then this is going to be amazing for you. The next sweater that I actually want to talk about is the Ultimate Oversized Sweater in the color Sand, size medium. So all these sweaters are gonna be in a size medium, but this is the sand colored one. And I think you can just tell how small this is and it's a medium compared to this one. Like this one, when I wear it, it kind of hangs off my arms, but this one for some reason kind of fits me very well. So if you're small, I would suggest getting a size large and if you're medium, get an extra large if you really want that oversized look. But I think this would be so cute to wear with like black sunglasses and like black biker shorts with some sneakers or just um, even around the house or black skinny jeans and go out in it um, it's not as soft on the outside as this one but they are all so comfy cozy on the inside they're just like this furry material I don't know if you can see that um, and they're not see-through so I think that's really good yeah I thought this was super cute I had to have it in this color because I don't know it's just really really nice Okay guys, so sad story about this one. This is the ultimate oversized sweater in the color light blue, size medium. And I wore it to get my hair dyed and look, the whole back is bleached on it. I mean, I can wear my hair down, nobody will really see it, but I was so sad about that. This one's a medium and it's a little bit bigger than the tan one, I did notice that. Um, same texture feeling. I feel like these sweaters will keep you warm, but at the same time, I live in Florida, so like, um, who am I to tell you what's gonna keep you warm in the cold when our cold is literally like 74 degrees I think this is super cute and honestly I can wear this probably with pretty much everything like black denim tan white i wore this to go get my hair done i have pictures in it on instagram and i just think it really brings out my green eyes so i just really like this color personally the next one i'm going to talk about is literally like i think this is my favorite one other than the california one that i got this is the gold coast sweater and it's the same gray as this but it's a little whiter so cute it says gold coast and it's really big and baggy just like this one super soft on the inside and the gold coast is like a pink writing with a little white underlying and i just think this is so nice when my hair is straight in and you don't know, feel myself and I'm running errands and I have no makeup on like this is the sweater I go to it's so cozy and like I can wear this in the airport I wear these sometimes to the beach too just because they're so big that like it looks super cute but I just really like it it's so comfy and the whole Gold Coast writing on to me like I just think it's so adorable and the name of that sweater was the Gold Coast Logan Oversized Sweater. It was $32. So this next sweater is actually the California Slogan Oversized Sweater and it was $32 and it is in a size medium. And I think this is so cute. So on the website it looks red, but it's actually black and orange, which I think is super cute. It's so cozy, so comfy. The outside of this is thicker than the two colored ones or the Gold Coast one that's pink. Um, but the inside is still so soft and it's super cute, really bad baggy, really oversized, and I just feel like, why do I need these many sweaters? <laughs> I have no reason. The next sweater that I have for you guys, my floor is shedding. This sweater is cute, okay? I saw it and I was like, ah, I gotta have it. This is the Darling Oversized Sweater in the color white, and it is $32 and it is adorable. I have no white sweaters. I bought a lot of gray, but I don't even own a regular white sweater in my closet. Like this is so cute and it says darling and pink on cursive in it. And I thought this was gonna be one of those pieces where it's like, yeah, I'll wear it every now and then, but I have so much gold jewelry that layers over it. It looks so cute. And now I have blonde hair, so I feel like that'll look even more cute because I'm just convincing myself that it will. Same thing, very soft on the inside, very oversized, good quality, you can't see through these at all and they keep me very very warm so if I'm like getting my hair done at a hospital like these guys keep me really warm the next thing that I got 
is the embroidered oversized sweater, pretty little thing, size medium color red. And it's this guy right here. Sorry that these sweaters have stuff all over them. My, my carpet sheds, like I have this rug that I got from Hobby Lobby and it sheds all over everything, even my dog. This is the red sweater and it's so cute. I think red looks really good with my green eyes. It makes them pop. I don't know why I think that, but it does. And the pretty little thing embroidery is in white and it's really cute, I think, because it's just a really cute saying, you know, pretty little thing. And it's the same thing, super soft on the inside. And they even have biker shorts that match these. So I thought that was super cute, but I'll probably just wear it with the black biker shorts and maybe even white jeans. I don't know, but I thought this was super cute, so comfy. When I look at this, I get inspired from makeup looks. So thought it was super cute. So this next sweater that I got, it's the same sweater in black. And I thought it was cute because I don't wear a lot of black. I'm a very colorful person. I love wearing, you know, neons and just exploring with my colors. So this is like the only like staple dark black piece that I have in my closet. And I think it's so comfy for when it's raining outside and I just want to be in something that's dark. Well, it kind of reminds me of Slytherin Harry Potter, not gonna lie. Um, but it says pretty little thing on it in white and it is so soft and cozy on the inside and it is in the size medium. And this was also $32 actually. Just kidding, how much was this? So the red sweater was $16 and the black sweater $16. So I was a stupid and I ordered my clothes on Dote. And Dote, they don't give you the site sales. So don't order your pretty little thing stuff off of Dote unless you have the promo code. They're like yay 50 or something. They're always having a sale, 75% off, 50% off. That's why some of that stuff was so cheap. The regular prices are like 32. Do not pay full price like I did. Pay for the half prices. And the half price for this was 16 bucks, which I think this is amazing for $16 because it is so high quality. I just feel like this is worth $45. This feels exactly like the Brandy Malvo one. The next sweater that I have for you guys is the Charcoal Amsterdam Slogan Oversized Sweater in the size medium color charcoal. And it is this guy right here. Um, so I really like this sweater. I think I liked it because I was looking for a sweater that said New York on it, hence why I got the one that said Los Angeles. But I thought Amsterdam was so cute. I just thought Amsterdam was adorable because I wanted something that had a slogan on it, like the Gold Coast and the pretty little thing. And I thought these big letters were adorable. I recently filmed an eyebrow tutorial in this, so you guys are gonna see these sweaters a lot in my next videos. I'll be living in these sweaters. Again, super cozy on the inside, very good material. Um, I like how on the collars of these, they're very low. They fit the neck really low. They're not really tight height and they're not like really square around the shoulders. They're very relaxed and I really appreciate that in a sweater. Okay guys, the last thing that I have for you. I felt like this went by like really quickly. This next item that I got is the dusty pink oversized zip front sweater in size medium. And to be honest, in the picture online, it looked orange. Like it looked like this peachy orange and I got it and she's pink, like pink, pink which I don't really mind, because like I said, I love color, but I was expecting the, the peachy kind of look. I'll insert a picture here of what I'm talking about, but I really wanted something like that. Like I really wanted that orangey, dusty color, because I have nothing that's kind of salmon like that. But this color is very, very pink. It has a few features that I actually like about it. I like the half zip. I was looking for a half zip sweater, like on Brandy, and they didn't have any more. Um, but like, it's a half zip, super cute. It has little side pockets. So the side pockets kind of zip. You can only fit like, I don't know, a pencil, a lipstick in here, but the side pockets don't fit for much. And these side pieces are Velcro, so you can Velcro them down and hook them around and make them like a tight piece or just leave them really open for like a street style or close them all the way around so it looks very baggy and oversized. This is huge on me. I ordered a medium in this. Um, and it's a crop top. So if you want to order a small, you can get something that's a little more tapered under your arms. But I thought the oversized big one would look really cute with the sweatpants or just jeans or anything like that. And yeah, it's super adorable on and I really like it with jeans, with sweatpants. So this guy's a really good contender, good quality crop top. And it was only, I think I already mentioned the price. I think for 16 bucks, that's pretty good. I don't know. Since Forever 21 is going out of business, y'all. 
pretty little thing is the next move. All right, guys, well, that is it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed this try on haul. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you are new here. Welcome. I'm so happy that I have you. Thanks so much for watching. If you like more videos like this on my bed where it's really chill, let me know because I film at my vanity and sometimes my vanity background can look a little eh, like not that cute. Thanks so much for watching, you guys, and until my next video, peace.